Um, actually, yeah, 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 that would be perfect. I will. Thank, Thank you so much, nice Kelsey. Have a good one. The top. We gonna lean in the frame. Yeah. Okay. What's going on, guys? Back for another vlog. Appreciate you coming here. <laughs> uh, so today, obviously, if you watch or if you read the title of this video, you've already clicked on it, so you know we're talking about street photography. And uh, for street photography, we've always taken a different approach. Uh, traditionally, people just take pictures of subjects as they're walking in the city and never interact with them and our approach has always been slightly different i don't know you can <laughs> yeah um it just it makes me think like we're, we usually like when we were doing yins are beautiful we would always try to stop and like have a nice interaction with a person get to know them a bit about their story and as i was thinking about it i'm like that comes from when we just shot with our friends because we had a point where it was like every month we were shooting with a, a different one of our friends and mm -hmm. we got to know them in a completely different light like it was one of those like true bonding moments and like really whenever we're going out and we're shooting street photography street photography we are aiming for the same thing like we want to just like make a quick new friend like showcase who they are like a little bit of their story like really actually tell something meaningful from each interaction instead of just oh it's a stranger click yeah the cool thing for me, I always felt was like Dave is taking the photo of somebody and I'm actually recording the actual interaction. And it just adds a, a level of depth to the art itself. Man, like you saw exactly what happened and like the expression that was on that person's face and maybe you understand why that happened too. Truth is strange, reality is always stranger than fiction. So we would have these interactions with people that would just be pure gold. Like you're never gonna, you would never have, you like, nobody's gonna believe it unless they see it. And the images would do a good job of telling the story, but like Shaman was saying, like it's a whole nother level of depth. And we want you guys to feel like you're right there with us whenever we're out here working on this project. Um, you guys are making friends too. Yeah, absolutely. Conveniently, <laughs> we are talking about this street photography because we ran into somebody that is literally legendary. Uh, his name is Richard Harris. Dave was like, oh, this guy looks interesting. We'll just let the interaction play out and you guys can be the judge of this. And I hope this inspires some of you to try the same thing where you record your interactions and change up the way you're doing street photography just to add even more depth to whatever you're doing. Cool. Right. <laughs> yeah, I don't have anything it. else to add. Not me neither. Oh, I'm Rich Hay. <laughs> George Benson, I'm the Temptations choreographer. What? No the way. Whispers, the OJs, the Smokey Robinson. I was with Dinah yes. Washington, the I Queen of the Blues, the 17. Uh, the George was with Jack McDuck. I did Return to Cinder behind Elvis Presley. I'm the Temptations choreographer, the Whispers, the old days. I love it. I love it. That's quite the recipe. What, what brings you to Pittsburgh? The hat. Pittsburgh, I live here. Pittsburgh, you love it? What, are you from here originally? Originally. Right here. Pittsburgh. What part of Pittsburgh? Four blocks from here called the Hill District. Oh, oh yeah. I know it. I know. Let so me you... smoke this first, man. For you. Oh, go ahead. Go, go for it. Yeah, I've been doing this 62 years. Okay. I'll be uh, 78 December. So I'm still, but I always tap dance with Sammy Davis Jr. and everybody. Bang. Bang. So how did you, they oh, you said you were doing, you, um, at 17, you kind of got your start into this. So how did you, uh, no? 15. 15. Me and George Spencer, 15. Then we left here at 17. Okay. We came down, caught a jitney from the hill, caught the Greyhound bus, went to New York. And two weeks, George sat in up in Harlem with Jack McDuck, Jay. He wanted to play Jay. He was great on that guitar. 15, 14, 
and we went with Dinah Washington the next one, Queen of the Blues. Next wow. thing I know, man, I'm with Elvis Presley. Returns and Detroit with Smokey. Well, I knew Smokey from years ago at a place called Joe West Trade Plaza. And he slipped all the groups used to come here. Joe brought them all in. So we knew everybody. Then everybody started to date. Man, it was on. I'm with the Marcells. I've been a Marcel Blue Moon, the hit record. Okay. Balm of a bomb, ding the dawn, day, blue. <laughs> I've been with the Marcells since Donna died in 63. I've been with the Marcells for 57 years. That's the same. That's the same. So all together, I've been out here in this business for 62, 63 years. That's wow. a beautiful career. That's a very long career. And everything is starting back up now. We got a book now for Detroit, Jersey, Philly. Broadway. So you're touring to this. You said you were still working. So where? So where is? When's your next show? I think the Beacon Theater in New York City. Beacon Theater. Tell the people where, where they can come yeah, see you. The Beacon Theater in New York City. All right. That's it. Broadway. <laughs> you saw it Broadway. I love it. It was. It was absolute pleasure to meet you. Can I ask your name again, sir? Uh, Richard Harris. Richard Harris. Richard Harris. I'm David Kelly. This is my friend Jamie. Jamie. Nice meeting you guys so nice much. So <laughs> things are starting to pick up with my friend George Benson. Starting to pick up from him, Stevie, because everybody got canceled out of the, the world tours and everything. And yeah, COVID dropped all of that. Chucked yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm with the Marcells, Blue Moon. So okay. we'll see you around somewhere in the world. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Mind if I take a quick portrait of you real quick? Ain't no problem. All right, I'm gonna have, um, actually, if I can have you stand like right here, I'll get you in this sunbeam real quick. go to family reunions, they all know you. Instead, everybody just like this. Look, man, everybody put their hand. You ought to see me at rehearsal with you, though. <laughs> gotta do it, man. Gotta, you gotta see you in Pittsburgh again sometime. I'm gonna have to you get up. So, the Marcel. The, the Marcel. I will. I will. I'm gonna look you up. I gotta see this. I gotta see your. You told me you're a resident. I gotta see this. That's incredible. I'm gonna be losing my mind. 